So Season of Opulence is out. What's up guys, Tony here. And let's check out some of the new gear and weapons that are out. Spoiler alert, I've already seen some of it, most of it if any. And I this is going to be a really negative video. Just heads up. So let's go to collections. This is live by the way, I'm not scripting this. I want you guys to see my raw feelings about this because I think it's important that you guys see my actual feelings about this and not like this scripted like thing. So we're gonna start off with armor first. And let me, okay, so Rise, or Rise of Iron. Uh, well, it has something to do with Rise of Iron. But for me, Iron Banner is always like something that I liked. I hated it in Destiny 1, kind of, but Rise of Iron really, really made me love it because some of the shit you got in, in that DLC was so good. So, for me, it kills me when we keep getting garbage as fucking armor. So, with that said, I have liked the Iron Truage to a certain extent. I like the helmet more than anything else. Anything other, honestly, I just like the helmet. Um, the Iron Pledge, I don't know because I just got this piece and I don't remember how it looks. Name, named Lord's Ornament, hands down the best Iron Banner armor set ever, probably. Iron Remembrance armor was a miss for me. I like the helmet. That's it. Maybe the cloak. That's it. Um, it looked a little too bad, uh, bulky on the on the character. Iron Fellowship armor. I really liked up until I found out that the cloak and the uh, shoes do not change color. That shit bugged me. The Iron Simaki is really cool. I actually use uh, the arm as a mainstay of my armor set. And then we have the Iron Truage, which is literally the Iron Truage from this one. It's literally the same armor set, just different fucking colors. So, yeah, hopefully, like, if you guys were hoping for new armor, like I was, Disappointment. Like, I am thoroughly fucking disappointed. I am just fucking livid. Like, I don't really expect much from these micro DLCs anymore. Like, it, I don't know if you guys noticed, but we haven't gotten a new uh, Crucible gear since Forsaken dropped. That bugs the shit out of me. I personally would have liked at least, like, Ornaments like they did back then that would have been okay. I guess but no like nothing. Okay, fine. Whatever but To give me a reskin of the first iron banner Like it would have been cool if they had reimagined the first armor set kind of like I don't know Let's let's do the armor. Let's not do that one because it's a cloak, but let's do the Titans Because it like got the same shit So this is how they looks the old one it would have been cool to like add more horns, add a ponytail, have the this part open up, like actually change it to signify that yeah, this is the armor from year one, but it's different because it's a different year. Instead of hey, literally, can I copy your homework? Yeah, just change it up a bit. Oh no, like what the fuck, bro? This is this is this next level of lazy that I was just like I was telling my friend not too long ago, I was like, dude, like, honestly, like, this is this is some next level lazy that I did not think what I would ever see. Like, this is some lazy shit right here. And this is just the first armor set. And I, I promise you guys, it, it just gets worse from here. So, Gambit, we got nothing from Gambit. I will say, I guess I'm okay with it because we do get all these fuck ton of fucking armor sets that no one's gonna fucking get. I say that, but I know people are going to get it. But mm, no new armor set for Gambit, which means I have no incentive of fucking doing Gambit now. Aside from the pinnacle weapon, which we get, we'll get to later. So, cool. No Gambit armor. Dope. Um, nothing here. That's from year one. But the Exodus down suit is back. It's just coming back as a year two version. Literally the same 
fucking armor, dog. Like, uh, I really don't expect much. Like, I'm, I promise you, like, I just want variety in armor. Like, especially since this is a quote-unquote looter shooter, I want loot. I don't want to get the same fucking loot that I've had for fucking years already. I don't have it on hit, but on my PS4 account I did. Like, I don't... Why, why do I want this now? I, I've already seen this. I've already had this. I don't want this shit again. So there's no point. What the fuck? Next one is... So the opulent stalker suit. So from, from people from Destiny 1, you guys will notice. This is just... This is armor from Destiny 1. Like... Fucking verbatim Destiny 1 armor. This one is even in Destiny 2 right now. It, just that it doesn't have the... The little box here but this was also a thing in destiny one there was this one and then there's the one with the box so i'm just kind of like bro like how are you gonna give reskins of old armor do they look cool i mean like they looked cool when i saw it in destiny one it looks cool when it all gold and purple shit it's cool don't get me wrong it's just uh, would have been cool if you redesigned it not just kind of like hey let's just splatter some callous themed pictures here and there people will like that people will think that's a good enough that's not good enough bro like what the fuck this is lazy <clears throat> i i think this is truly lazy i think this is like the pinnacle of lazy like literally if we just go up a little bit more whoa whoa what is this it looks like the fucking cloak we're getting this season except for the fucking thing here what else this helmet Looks familiar? It's because we got this helmet and this helmet at the same fucking DLC. I don't remember what DLC it was though. So, I don't like this armor already. Am I gonna get it? Obviously, this it's from the Menagerie, I'm pretty sure. And I actually love the Menagerie. It's not all negative. I really love the Menagerie and I'll get to that when we get to that. That's another video by the way. So, We'll get to that when it, when we get to that. But let's go to factions, which I don't even know why this is here anymore. There's no factions anymore. All right, so all right, so I am not the biggest fan of this season's armor from Eververse, only because no, that's wrong. Only because it just kind of seems basic to me. Like I. I, I feel like I know what they were going for, but I'm not saying it's trash. It's just not my style. So I'm not saying like, oh, you fucked up on this one. No, not my style. Just I personally don't like it. Will I use some of these pieces? Uh, maybe. I don't. I that's a hard maybe. I don't know. Like I really don't know. When I get all the pieces, I probably will like see if I like some pieces, and see like I maybe like the pants because it really does go well with. Uh, the foxtails. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I might I might use these boots because I don't have regular boots that I wear for for my titan, so these might be my permanent boots. But let me see. This is from Destiny 1 or Destiny 2 Year 1. So again, whatever. And this is the Solstice armor, which is this armor right here. Which, if it's just this armor, but you have to grind for it again, and then you just get, instead of these um, ornaments, not ornaments, armor, instead of these armor glows, you just get the new ones that are out, then I'm going to be really salty because I had to farm for these shits last time. And then, like, after I was done, I realized, fuck, I'm not going to use this armor anymore. Why the fuck did I farm for all this shit? But I was still would have farmed for it because I want to complete it. So, yeah, that's it for that one. End game. It's uh, I haven't done the raid. No one's in the raid, so I'm I'm literally doing this like after what four hours after the DLC dropped. So I don't know how this looks like yet. If it looks dope, I'm gonna be really happy. If the raid is awesome, I'm gonna be really happy. But in general, I fucking loathe and i mean loathe the amount of lazy shit they have done this fucking season like bro 
like I am just absolutely astonished that they're, they're doing this level of fucking petty like this is just petty like this is lazy and just fucking ugh. never in my life dog like literally look at this same fucking armor I haven't unlocked the the menagerie for my warlock yet oh I can still see it though but yeah this is destiny 1 for sure all destiny 1 armor sets that's the fucking two year one armor. It's just like, I don't think I expect much. All I expect is new armor or armor that looks passive, like pass, like uh, passable. Like, okay, cool. Yeah, that looks different. Not like we just added gold trims here and there. Like, ugh, I don't know, dog. Am I, am I like, look. Guys, am I am I being too critical? Like, am I just being like, oh, Tony, you just hate the game? Like, am I being that guy? Because I was just enjoying Menagerie not too long ago, and I was loving it. But when I see these armors, it just kind of kills my soul. I think the only good thing, and like, I mean, like, I'm really trying to like stretch it. Like, the only good thing is now I can wear this again. Like, that, like the my favorite armor set from what was that? Um, Warmind. My favorite um, Iron Banner from Warmind, so I, I can wear that again now. So I can put that in my whoever I choose to wear it with. So that's cool, I guess. But no no Gambit armor, like really? Like it would have been cool to have new Gambit armor that's not slightly similar to the fucking vanilla one. Which, that bugged me as well, but it looked different enough to where I was like, eh, whatever, it's fine. Would have still been cool if, you know, the collector had a different outfit than the Sentry. But, you know, again, whatever. It's not this season anymore. Again, like, same shit, different fucking character. Same shit, dog. Like, it's just... Let, let's just leave, because I've already said enough. So, for what... I'm just going to go here for weapons. For, for weapons... I said this on my last video, but this is basically the design of Elsie, Els, Els Luna. I forget the, the name of it. Or Hawkmoon. This is the design of it from year one of Destiny. So, uh, again, I, I'm hype as fuck. I love the design of this gun. I've always loved it since I first saw it. Am I hyped that it's in the game again? Uh, kind of, not really. It would have been cool, like, if we got a new exotic, or not a new exotic, but a new, like, hand cannon design. This one I mixed more because of the memories I have with Hawkmoon, because that's my favorite gun from Destiny 1, aside from Galahorn. But it just kind of, it's bittersweet. Like, yes, this is, this weapon design is back, but fuck, it's back. What the fuck? very hard to explain uh mita multi-tool or mita mini tool literally still has the fucking mita right there this one is just <clears throat> this one really bugs me this one really bugs me a lot when i fucking see it uh the drang literally just the fucking drang imperial decree this looks like uh a fucking blue bro this looks like one of the blues i get except like the barrel's different This looks like Plan B, I think it was called, or any, like one of the exotics from Destiny 1. <clears throat> this one looks cool, but I know it kind of looks like a blue as well. And when I say blue, it looks like a rare. That's what I'm saying. It looks like a rare. Fixed odds. Uh, this one could be a design from Destiny 1. I'm not too sure. I didn't use many machine guns, so... I'll, I'm not gonna judge that one that harshly. Gold tusk. It's literally dog. It's literally fucking. It's literally quick thing, bro. It's literally quick thing. Year two quick thing. That's dope, I guess. What else? Uh, that's it. Yeah. Ghost is a uh, just has shiny shit. Would have been cool if it was a little bit more different instead of just hey, I'm a ghost, but like I'm gold in purple y'all like whatever dog um this one doesn't really bug me too much 
just because of um I wasn't exp I never expect much from a ghost anymore after some of the horrid designs they've done so that's just me though garbage this is a basic bitch fucking sparrow bro you're gonna give me a basic bitch sparrow thanks cool uh and then the armor sets for this too let's see the shaders this looks cool i like that i like that one a lot actually uh this kind of looks like a vanguard armor or a color set this one looks really cool. It reminds me of Callus' uh, Chosen, I think it's called. The the OG uh, the OG raid, the first raid in Destiny 2. That shader. We'll check it out in a bit. And then Gold Leaf. Eh, not that. I don't really care about that. But yeah, these are the these are the weapons. Uh, there's probably more. Well, probably there's there's more. Probably in the raid. But from from what I from what I see, I'm just not excited. I don't give a fuck about any of this shit except the Ostringer, and um, that's it. Cause the fuck, I, again, I don't give a fuck about any of these. Uh, maybe some of these. I don't know what the fuck they would be, but I, I'll hold my judgment until these come out. Cause uh, why the fuck would I judge it now if I don't see it? The armor hopefully looks good, but I'm just thoroughly disappointed that some of the shit we're getting is just kind of disappointing and then like obviously the majority of the fucking shaders are behind the eververse eververse is gonna have her own separate video because oh my god i fucking love and hate what they did with her so royal welcome let me see uh, i can see myself using it i don't know if i would like myself using it though first light Oh, that looks cool, but I probably wouldn't wear it personally. <clears throat> Holy shit, this looks good. I want to wear this. I might, I might go out. Oh no, wait. I have a rule that I can't wear shaders from Eververse because I just refuse to. But that looks good though. Fuck. Kind of. I kind of want to break my rule for that. This kind of looks like the Metro one, but okay. Coastal suede. Nah, not that big a fan of that one. And yeah, I... Oh shit, yeah, that's right. Let me check out some of these. Crucible Carmen. This one doesn't look that bad. Hmm. Actually, hold on. Let me change my character to how they they would actually look. <laughs> and not like... Why they look like that. Okay, let's... Yeah. Oh, my flare... Activities, okay. Crucible, let's go back. That looks pretty cool. I wish this was black, but that's fine. It still looks cool though. It looks really cool. Crucible. Uh, I don't like. I don't like it on this armor set. It doesn't meld well. But I like the colors. All right, so Iron Bone, which is that. I don't like. I don't like this shader. Um, well, I I like it and hate it. I like the cool like difference in color but i don't think gold is very nice on this color or on this shader i think if the gold was out it'd be better mm. iron gold that looks weird like it doesn't look bad it just looks weird mm. so this is the one i meant og callus kind of reminds me of that but just like darker let me see Oh, I guess you can't see it. Oh, I guess it's a raid one, huh? All right, that's fine. Uh, it's from this new hole. Not are you uh, Gambit Steel. That looks pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if I would wear it. It looks cool, though. It looks really cool. Gambit Blackguard. Nah, I'm not a big fan of that. Tower. Did we get anything for the tower? Yeah, aside from, from that. Oh, two of them. Vanguard Steel. Never been a big fan of Vanguard's like colors. It's just the different, like it's just the same color, but just different like ways to color it. It's just, it's just weird. This one's actually pretty cool. I like this one. This is cool. And open world, let's see. 
Oh, okay. So this is uh. This, oh, so this okay, okay. This is the one I was talking about. Oh shit! This is basically uh the one before uh, Callus is chosen, is it? But just instead of white, it's black, and the colors are darker. That's pretty cool. I like this one. Yeah, I'm an edge lord. Fuck off, right? Let me see. Cinder char. Still reminds me of Vanguard armor or color. Golden Empire. Yeah, we already saw these. Yeah, we already saw these. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. So yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's how that is. Um, uh, overall, I am fucking disappointed in the gear. Some of this gear is fucking not trash looking. It's just like I've already seen that this DLC has nothing new for me. Kind of like that's how I feel. Like it's nothing new for my eyes. It's just kind of like hey, like we just wanted to do something like. In games like World of Warcraft, I get it, like, I get that they do that because, you know, they're pulling from, what, 10 years ago armor sets, so that's fine. Especially when it's true nostalgia, like, oh my god, I haven't seen this armor in, two, in like, almost 10 years. And to see it in high such res is beautiful, you know, that type of shit, I get. This, dog, Destiny 1 wasn't too long ago. It was like, what, oh shit, it was, it was a while ago. But... They're choosing armor that was like very niche, like not like armor that was like the shit, like an armor set that I think would be, would have been a better choice and I would have been hype as fuck for it, would have been the armor you get when the Taken King came out. That armor for all of those classes were fucking fire, bro. I'm not even fucking with you. That's just me. I, what the fuck do I know? It's not like I've been playing Destiny since the fucking beta. But that was the video, guys. Hopefully you liked it. Let me know what you guys think about this new uh, mini expansion, DLC, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I personally did not like that. The next video, we are going to be talking about the Eververse and Eververse why I hate and love it. And yeah, let me know what you guys think about it. Follow me on my, on my social media outlets. Links are in the description below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Later.